I'm Alan Edwards from Driving.ca at the Toronto Spring Classic Car Auction at the International Centre here in Toronto, where more than 300 vehicles are going to cross the auction block. Everything from a 1915 Model T Ford Depot hack to a 2006 Bentley Flying Spur. There's something for everybody here. There's uh, inexpensive cars that will go for a little better than $2,000, and there are cars that will go for $100,000. There's literally thousands of people from all over Canada that come to this auction. I talked to some people from Alberta, some people from Quebec. They're all here enjoying the action at the auction. And uh, let's see what happens. A lot of cars are going to sell here. Muscle car enthusiasts here at the Toronto Spring Classic Car Auction. There's this 1971 Pontiac Firebird Trans Am in beautiful blue color. This is one of 239 built. It's got a 455 cubic inch high output HO engine coupled to a Muncie four speed transmission. The owner claims $75,000 was spent on a rotisserie restoration, and it really shows that quality. A beautiful car. Spirit touches in my mind, they grow and press in my eyes. As time moves on, they feel stronger. My reality lingers a little longer. And Brian, you own this 1936 Packard limousine with quite a history. Yep. Tell me about that. Uh, the Packard uh, itself here is 1936. It was purchased brand new uh, from uh, by the Walker Hotel for as uh, act as their limo service from, in uh, Kitchener, right? Kitchener, yeah. Uh, they presumably they would pick up guests at the train station, bring them to the hotel, and then transport them back when their stay was over. All original uh, interior and paint, as the battle scars reflect. Well, good luck today, Brian. Wish Thanks you well with much. your beautiful car. Thank, right, you. thank you. Could they hold the dream so dear? Could they hold the answers clear? A bland life with nothing fell. It's a real feeling of approaching hell. One of the more interesting vehicles here at the Toronto Spring Classic Car Auction is a 1952 Chevrolet ice cream truck. It served as an ice cream truck in Texas on the Texas Panhandle. It was uh, restored seven years ago. It was made in Lansing, Michigan. It's got a freezer on the back that works and it's got advertising of fudgicles and popsicles all over it. My estimate on this vehicle is probably going to be about $30,000 as it crosses the auction block. We'll see.